Assalamu alaikum my dear students as you know that we are discussing the 19th century and in the previous lecture we have discussed some improvement some development some innovations that had been carried out that had taken place in the print technology or printing technology in the 19th century and because of which now this printing became a sophisticated process because of which the printed texts became very beautiful their appearance their look was now better it was transformed now and they look uh, their look was now their appearance was now uh, good these were now good looking textbooks and printed textbooks and now we will carry forward this discussion and because of this these new innovations now new strategies were adopted new strategies were adopted by by these printers and publishers printers and publishers they adopted new techniques they adopted new methods for what in order to sell their products sorry in order to sell their product so these printers and publishers seeing the changes seeing the innovations that were taking place at that time in the print technology they also adopted new techniques they are also adopted new methods in order to sell their product apne product apne kitabon ko ya baaki jo bhi publish hota tha ya jo bhi hai magazines wagera ya print hota tha इन्होंने कोशिश की आप उसको सेल आउट करने की नए तरीके से उन्होंने नए तरीके अपनाए एंड ज्यूरिंग द नाइनटीन सेंचुरी ए न्यू वे ए न्यू वे ऑफ राइटिंग नॉवल्स इट स्टार्ट 19th century mein ek aur development ho gayi that was related to the novel writing actually a new particular way of writing novels started it began and what was that that was periodicals periodicals serialized huh? important novels that means all the important novels they were now written in a new way that is period through periodicals they were serialized all the important novels jo bhi important novels thi unko periodicals ke tahat periodicals ke under jo hai serialize kiya gaya अब उनको जो है ऑर्डरिंग दी दी गई नाउ दिस वाज अनदर चेंज एंड इन इंग्लैंड इन इंग्लैंड इन 1920s इन इंग्लैंड इन 1920s पॉपुलर novels or popular sorry popular works popular books they were sold popular works were sold jo mashhoor works thi kitabein thi unko beja gaya they were sold in a cheap series एक सस्ती सीरीज में जो है उनको बेच दिया गया 
all the popular works, all the important works were published in a chief series. A chief series nikali gayi, jis mein paper vagera jo hai, wo chief tha, aur wo saste jo hai, saste series kehlaaye. Kyunki wo saste, bohot saste thi, us mein bohot zyada jo hai, discount mila, aur wo jo hai, wo bohot saste daam mein beji gayi wo series, wo books. And those series came to be known as shilling series. In ko shilling series kaha jata hai. Sometimes in your examination, there can be a question, this objective type question or this a term can be asked in your examination. That is, you can be asked to write what is shilling series. So shilling series is a cheap series. That was published in England around 1920s, in which all the popular works they were sold out. जो भी popular works थे, वो उनको बेचा गया cheap series में, सस्ती series में उस series का नाम रखा गया shilling series. And in 20th century, in 20th century, another innovation took place. And that innovation was book jacket. Innovation of book jacket. Book jacket innovation. Books के ऊपर जो है अगर आपने देखा होगा वो jacket सा लगा होता है जिसको हम book jacket कहते हैं और dust covering. जो गंदगी होती है उस गंदगी से बचने के लिए बुक के ऊपर जो है एक कवरिंग होती है डस्ट कवर उसको कहते हैं और इट इज आल्सो कॉल्ड बुक जैकेट एंड दिस बुक जैकेट इज पॉपुलर नाव डेज ऑल द गुड बुक्स मेरी अथेंटिक बुक्स दे आर ओवर देम देयर इज दिस बुक जैकेट एंड दिस बुक जैकेट इज ट्वेंटी सेंचुरी इनोवेशन इसको इन्वेंट किया गया इनोवेट किया गया है ट्वेंटी सेंचुरी में and as you know in 1930s around 1930s especially in 19 in october 1929 this 1939 sorry this 1930s is called the period of great depression एक बहुत बड़ा डिप्रेशन जो है दुनिया में चला विच इज आल्सो कॉल्ड द इकोनॉमिक क्राइसिस ऑफ 1929 एंड दिस ग्रेट डिप्रेशन इट बिगेन इन यूएस ये यूएस में शुरू हुआ था इन अक्टूबर 1929 एट एंड इट कंटिन्यू टिल दिस 1933-34 एंड ड्यूरिंग दिस ग्रेट डिप्रेशन दिस ग्रेट डिप्रेशन वाज एक्चुअली it began when in New York, America, the stock market exchanges, they crashed, unka crash hota hai, and these crises started, this great depression started there. And this great depression had almost affected all the major countries of the world, not to talk of this only America, but all the countries of the world. With some exceptions. And this great depression, with the coming of this great depression, this had also its impact so far as the book purchasing process is concerned. Book purchasing power. It also affected the book purchasing power. It This great depression reduced the book परचेजिंग पावर जो बुक परचेजिंग पावर था जो लोग किताबें खरीदते थे उनके पास मुनी थी अब चूंकि क्राइसिस हो गया ग्रेट डिप्रेशन हो गया बिकॉज ऑफ दिस नाउ पीपल वेर नॉट एबल टू परचेज द बुक्स बुक्स परचेज वो नहीं कर सकते थे सो दिस पीरियड ऑफ ग्रेट डिप्रेशन लेट टू डिक्लाइन सो दिस ग्रेट डिप्रेशन 
led to decline in it led to decline in book purchase book purchases इसीलिए इसकी वजह से जो है ग्रेट डिप्रेशन की वजह से बुक परचेज बुक्स जो खरीदी जा रही थी उसमें न, जो है डिक्लाइन जवाल देखा गया बहुत कम लोग जो है इन किताबों को खरीद सकते थे क्योंकि उनके पास मनी पावर जो है इनकम जो है वो बहुत ज्यादा गिर गई एंड टू ओवरकम दिस प्रॉब्लम इन आर्डर टू ओवरकम दिस प्रॉब्लम of decline in book purchases what publishers did publishers brought out a new collection of the books a new edition of the books and that edition of books is called the cheap paperback editions remember these things this is very important in order to overcome the decline that this great depression had in the purchasing of books publishers tried to brought out cheap paperback editions inhone publishers ne ab cheap paper quality editions nikale और इन चीफ पेपर बैक एडिशन का पेपर जो था कागज जो था वो बहुत सस्ता था इसका दैट वाज चीफ चीफ पेपर वाज यूज एंड दीज वायर सोल्ड एट चीप रेट्स इनकी क्वालिटी की पेपर जो पेपर क्वालिटी थी वो भी चीप थी एंड आल्सो दे वायर सोल्ड एट चीप रेट्स ये चीप रेट्स पे जो है बड़े सस्ते दामों पे ये पेज दिए गए सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट द नाइनटीन सेंचुरी हाउ नाइन वट आर द वेरियस इनोवेशन दैट टू प्लेस इन नाइनटीन सेंचुरी सो आई होप दैट यू हैव अंडरस्टूड दिस टॉपिक थैंक यू